Welcome everybody, it's Kelly, Ashtanga Yoga. Ashta means eight, Anga is a limb. Patanjali's Yoga Sutras um, describe eight limbs of yoga, Yama, Niyama, Asana, Pranayama, Pratyahara, Dharana, Dhyana, and Samadhi. So practicing Ashtanga Yoga, it means practicing all of the eight limbs. And it's really important to understand each and every limb as they're all interconnected and they lead to the final limb, samadhi, or the realization of higher consciousness. The tristana in ashtanga, first of all, tri meaning three in Sanskrit, shtana meaning standing place. And the tristana are breathing, posture, and drishti, or gaze point. And these are really important places of action. And they should always be observed and practiced simultaneously throughout your asana practice. So enjoy your practice. Listen to your body. Listen to your breath. It's a bit of a fast-led uh, primary series today. But move guided by the Sanskrit count. And when you lose your breath, or if you're holding your breath, take a child's pose. Do what you need to do to come back to your breath and to come back to the practice. Come to the top of your mats. Take your hands in prayer. Root your feet down, toes together, heels a sliver apart, and find your ocean breath, gentle sounded breath. Let yourself be guided by my Sanskrit count. Yekam, inhale, reach up, relax, shoulders. Dwe, exhale, forward fold. Trini, inhale, look up, long spine. Chatwari, exhale, step or hop back, bend the elbows, chaturanga. Punch, inhale, upward dog. Shut, exhale, downward dog. Slow, deep, steady, rhythmic breath for one. Spreading the fingers wide, rooting down the index knuckle, two. Relaxing your shoulders away from your ears, maybe rolling the underneath of the arms towards one another. Three, hollowing the belly. Four, and five. Sup to inhale, step hop or float up, look up, and ashtau, exhale, forward fold. Now a inhale, rise up, exhale, samastiti. Yekam, inhale, dwe, exhale. Trini, inhale, look up. Chatwari, exhale, chaturanga, elbows grazing ribs, punch, inhale, upward dog, shut, exhale, downward dog. Sounded breath, keeping you present and in the moment. One, listening to the body and the messages it is sending you, noticing where you're feeling restricted or tight. Two, breathe a little more space into that area and exhale out the tension. Three, four, and five. Sub to inhale, step up, float up, look up, ashtau, exhale. Now inhale, rise up, root down, exhale, samastiti, hands by your sides. Yekam, inhale, urdva hastasana, dwe, exhale, uttanasana. Trini, inhale, ardha uttanasana, chatwari, exhale, chaturanga. Panja, inhale, urdva mukha, shoulders relax, shut, exhale, Aromuka. One. Two. Three. Four. And five. Sub to inhale. Step up or float up, look up halfway, ashtau, exhale. Now inhale, rise up, exhale, samastiti. Yekam, inhale, press your palms together, dwe, exhale, forward fold. Trini, inhale, long spine, chatwari, exhale, integral chaturanga. Punch, inhale, strong legs, shut, exhale, peace in downward dog. One. Two, three, 
four and five. Sup to inhale, step hop or float up. Look up, ashta, exhale. Now inhale, rise up. Exhale, samastiti, last sun cell A, yekam, inhale. Dwe, exhale. Trini, inhale. Chatwari, exhale. Punch, inhale, press into hands and feet. Shut, exhale, hips take you back. Downward dog. One, eventually your heels will come down to the earth. Maybe not today, maybe not next week or next year. Two. Three, a little bend in the knees if you're feeling resistance at the sits bones. Four. And five. Sup to inhale. Step, hop, or float up. Look up. Ashtau, exhale. Now inhale, rise up. Exhale, samastiti, sun cell B. Yekam, inhale, chair pose. Dwe, exhale, forward fold. Trini, inhale, look up. Chatwari, exhale, chaturanga, pancha, inhale. Shut, exhale, virabhadrasana, A. Sup to inhale, right foot steps. Left foot pivots down, press your palms together, gaze to thumbs. Ashtau, exhale, chaturanga. Now inhale. Dasha, exhale. Ekadasha, inhale, left foot steps. Right foot pivots down. Press to the outside edge of that right foot. Dwadasha, exhale. Triodasha, inhale. Chaturdasha, exhale. Slow, deep, steady, rhythmic breath. One. Two. Three, four, five. Panchadasha, inhale, float up, look up. Shodasha, exhale, forward fold. Sabdadasha, inhale, deep knee bend. Utkatasana, exhale, standing samastiti. Yekam, inhale, Utkatasana, relax shoulders. Dwe, exhale, forward fold. Tree, inhale, look up. Chatwari, exhale, chaturanga. Pancha, inhale, upward dog, and shut, exhale. Sup to inhale, right foot steps. Draw the right hip back, left hip forward as you gaze up. Ashtau, exhale, chaturanga. And Nawa, inhale. Dasha, exhale. Ekadasha, inhale, left foot steps. Draw the left hip back, right hip forward. Relax those shoulders, gaze up. Dwadasha, exhale, chaturanga. Triodasha, inhale. Chaturdasha, exhale. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Panchadasha, inhale, float up, look up. Shodasha, exhale, forward fold. Saptadasha, deep knee bend, inhale, Utkatasana. Exhale, standing, Samastiti, last B, Yekam, inhale. Dwe, exhale. Trini, inhale, look up. Chatwari, exhale, Chaturanga. Pancha, inhale, upward dog. Shut, exhale, downward dog. Sapta, inhale, right foot steps up. Ashtau, exhale, chaturanga. Nawa, inhale. Dasha, exhale. Ekarsha, inhale, left foot steps. Dwarsha, exhale, chaturanga. Triodasha, inhale. Chaturdasha, exhale. Starting to slow the breath down if it started to speed up. Come back to your center. Come back to your peace. Two. Three. Four. Five. Panchadasha. Inhale. Float up. Look up. 
Shodasha, exhale, forward fold. Sabdadasha, inhale, deep knee, bend, Utkatasana. Exhale, standing, Samastiti, Parangushtasana, hands to your waist, hop your feet, hip distance. Yekam, inhale, reach down for your big toes, bend your knees if you need, lift your chest. Dwe, exhale, bend the elbows and forward fold. Relax your shoulders. One. Belly on the thighs, eventually face between the shins. Two. Feel your inhales lifting your sits bones, your exhale dropping your head to the earth for three. Four. Five. Trini, inhale, look up. Exhale there. Padahastasana, yekam, inhale, palms of hands to soles of feet. And away, exhale, bend the elbows and forward fold. Let your head hang down off of the spine to allow for decompression. Two. Three. Four. Trini, inhale, look up and exhale, hands to the waist. Inhale, rise up, hop your feet together, samastiti. Trikonasana, yekam, inhale, step your right foot out, turn the feet to the back, kick your left hip out, reach your right ribs long over your right leg, hand to the shin or to the big toe and gaze up towards your left fingers. Two, roll your left shoulder back behind the right, open up your chest. Three, four, five, turn your inhale, come on up, turn your left foot forward, kick your right hip out. Chatwari, exhale, reach for your left big toe, gaze up towards your right fingers, long sides of the torso, one. Press to the inside edge of the feet, inner thighs active, two. Press into the ball of the left foot so you don't hyperextend, three, four, five. Turn your inhale, come on up, turn to square your hips off at the back, maybe look, move your left foot. Dway, exhale, long spine as you take your left hand to right shin or to the floor outside of your right foot. Twist your body open to the right and gaze up to the right fingers. One, strong inner thighs. Two, back heel grounded. Three, lift the chest, open the collarbones. Four, five, Trini, inhale, come on up. Turn to square your hips off at the front of the mat. Chatwari, exhale, long spine as you take that right hand outside of your left foot or onto left shin. Lift the chest, twist from an elongated spine, not a flexed spine. Open up the collarbones, one. Relax that left shoulder, two, three, four, and five. Punch inhale, come on up. Little turn to the right, exhale, Samasiti, top of the mat. Yutita Parshvakanasana, Yekam, inhale, bigger step out to the right, arms parallel. Dwe, exhale, right hand outside of right foot. Left hand reaching beyond the head, left shoulder relaxed, gaze at your palm, pinky to the earth, one. Press the knee into the arm so it's not collapsing into midline, two. Press to the outside edge of your back foot, three, four. Five, Trini, inhale, come on up, turn the left foot towards the front. Chatwari, exhale, left hand outside of left foot, reach the right arm to the back, right shoulder relaxed, one. Left thigh parallel to the earth for two. Left ribs rolling towards the sky for three, four, five. Trini, inhale, come on up. Good. Dwe, exhale, square off the hips. Prayer twist or left hand outside of right foot, reaching the right arm towards the back. Open right side rib cage. One, press to the outside edge of that foot or keep the heel lifted. Two, three, four, and five. Good. Trini, inhale, come on up. Turn to square your hips off at the front. Maybe you're lifting up that right heel. Full expression, it's down. Chatwari, exhale. Right elbow outside of left knee. Prayer twist or hands to the earth outside of that left ankle. Reaching the left arm long, relaxing the shoulder and opening up your left side rib cage. Pulling that left hip back and down. One. Press to the outside edge of that right foot. Two. Three. Roll the heart towards the sky. Four. And five. Very nice. Punch, inhale, come on up, little turn to the right, 
Exhale, Samastiti, top of the mat. Prasarita, hands to the waist, step your right foot out, about four feet, toes in. Dwe, exhale, hands to the earth, underneath your shoulders. Inhale, lengthen the heart. Trini, exhale, forward fold, intending your heart to the earth, long spine. If your arms are bent, elbows on top of the wrists for one. Engage your legs strongly. Sink weight to the balls of the feet. Two, try to relax your shoulders. Three, four, and five. Good, strong legs. Chatwari, inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, hands to the waist. Inhale, rise up and exhale there. I'm turning so you can see where my arms are. Yay, come inhale. Dwe, exhale to the waist. Inhale there. Trini, exhale, forward fold. Strong legs so you don't roll forward. Squeeze the elbows into shoulder distance. Thumbs are facing each other. One, legs are strong. Two, sits bones are lifting. Three, Uddiyana Bandha, belly tucked for spinal length. Four, very nice. Five, Chatwari, inhale, come all the way up. Exhale there. Ye come, inhale, arms parallel. Dwe, exhale, interlace your hands. Inhale, open your chest. Trini, exhale, forward fold. Try to touch the pinkies to the earth. Now if your head's touching the earth, just press to the back of the head a little bit. Tuck your chin. This will release your traps and take those hands down, opening the chest. Two, three, four, and five. Strong legs. Chatwari, inhale. Come all the way up. Exhale there, yekam, inhale, hands to your waist. Dway, exhale, reach down for your big toes, peace, fingers, and thumbs. Inhale, lift the chest, keep that length. Trini, exhale, bend the elbows out to the side, forward fold with lots of length, shoulders relaxed. Two, three, four, five. Chatwari, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, hands to the waist, punch, inhale, rise up, exhale, Samastiti, top of the mat. Parshvatanasana, yekam, inhale, reverse namaste, or take your knuckles together. When you're ready, step your right foot back, turn towards the back, square your hips off once you turn. Maybe requiring you to adjust that left foot, then dwe, exhale, bow over your right leg. Pulling the right hip up and back, left hip forward and down. One, reaching your chin, your heart towards that right foot. Two, that's where your drishti, your gaze is at the right big toe. Three, strong legs. Four, long legs. And five, trini inhale, come on up, turn to square your hips off at the front. Chatwari, exhale, bow over your left leg, drawing your left hip up and back, right hip forward and down and reaching your heart towards that left big toe. One, first belly to the thigh, then chin to the shin. Two, keep elongating your spine. Three, four, and five. Punch, inhale, come on up, little turn to the right. Exhale, Samasthiti, top of the mat. Yutita Hasta Parangushtasana. Yekam, inhale, reach for your right big toe or your right knee, left hand at your waist. If you have your big toe and your leg is straight, dwe, exhale, forward fold, bow over that right leg for one, relax your shoulders. Two, try to straighten your standing leg. Three, four, five. Trini, inhale, come on up. Chatwari, exhale, take the leg out to the right without taking the right hip with it. Look over your left shoulder if you can. Open up the collarbone. Squeeze the shoulders. One, two, three, four, five. Punch, inhale, bring it forward. Shut, exhale, forward fold. Step to inhale, stand tall. Hold the leg up, both hands at your waist. Point the toe. One, try not to lean back. Two, open up the chest. Three, root down the leg. Four, and five, exhale, take it down. Ashtau, inhale, grab your left knee or your left big toe. If you have that toe and the leg is straight, now exhale, forward fold over that leg. One, two, three, 
four, five. Dasha, inhale, stand tall. Ekadasha, exhale. Take the leg out to the left. Don't take the left hip with it. Look over your right shoulder if you can. One, two, three, four, and five. And what a shot. Inhale, bring that leg forward. Try out a shot. Exhale, forward fold. Chatur de Shah, inhale, stand tall, both hands at your waist, point your toe, that leg is straight, no bend. One, two, three, four, five. Exhale, take it down. Ardha Bada Padmottanasana, Yekam, inhale, take your right leg into half lotus, up into the hip crease or into tree. Reach the right arm around to grab the left forearm and walk your fingers down or grab the toe, and if you have the toe, Dway, exhale, Forward fold, only if you have the toe, otherwise you stay up and you work the shoulder opening, the hip opening, the balance, and your drishti. Two, three, four, and five. Good. Trini, inhale, look up halfway, exhale there. Chatwari, inhale, we all hold the foot as we come on up. Pancha, exhale, let that foot go. Shut, inhale, left leg half lotus or tree. Reach around with that left hand to grab the right forearm and walk your fingers down or grab the foot. And if you have it, sup to exhale, forward fold, right hand beside right, right foot and eventually chin to your shin. One, two, three, four, and five, Ashtau, inhale, look up halfway, now I exhale there, Dasha, inhale, come on up, and exhale, release the foot, top of the mat, Yekam, inhale, reach up with relaxed shoulders, gaze to your thumbs, Dway, exhale, forward fold, Trini, inhale, look up, Chatwari, exhale, Chaturanga, Pancha, inhale, Urdhva Mukha, Shut, exhale, Adho Mukha. Sup to inhale, Utkatasana. Float your feet up, take your feet and knees together. Bend your knees, weight and heels. Palms pressing together, gaze up with your whole head. Relax your shoulders as you lift your sternum. One, two, three, a little more weight in your heels. Four, five, Ashtau, exhale, forward fold. Now inhale, lift up. Dasha Chaturanga, Ekadasha, inhale, and Dwadasha, exhale. Septa, inhale, Virabhadrasana, A. Step your right foot forward, press your palms together, look up, one. Press to the outside edge of your back foot for two. Draw the right hip back, three, four, five. Keep your gaze at your thumbs, turn towards the back, square the hips off, and Ashtau, sink in for one. Two, three, four, five. Now inhale, open up to Vira B. Don't move your feet. Gaze over left finger. One, two. Pull the left knee out in line with the baby toe. Three, using your external rotators. Four, five. Inhale, come on up through to center. Dasha, exhale. Sink into Vira B. Right leg, one. Soft shoulders, jaw, space between your eyebrows. Two. Three, four, five. Ekadasha, cartwheel down. Dwadasha, chaturanga. Triodasha, inhale. Chaturdasha, exhale. Dandasana. So we're going to jump through to our seat. Our legs are going to be out straight, palms into the earth beside our hips. Long spine, shoulder squeezing, forward tilt of the pelvis. That's where our forward folds begin. Legs internally rotated. Good. Nice little forward tilt. Bend your knees a little bit if your hamstrings are really tight to encourage the forward tilt. One. Two. Drishti tip of the nose. Three. Four. And five. Ashtau, inhale. Paschimottanasana. Grab those toes. And now I exhale, forward fold. Intend your heart to touch your toes. One, two, three, four. 
five. Dasha, inhale. Look up. Ekadasha, exhale. Grab the sides of the feet, the wrists of the soles of the feet or your big toes, and exhale. Forward fold. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Dwada Sha, inhale, look up, and exhale there. First lift, cross your legs, inhale, lift up, Triota Sha, Chaturta Sha, exhale, step or hop back, Panchata Sha, inhale, Chaturta Sha, exhale. That was a mixed up count. <laughs> Sapta jumping through, Purvottanasana, Ashtao, inhale, lift up, hands were six inches behind the hips. Toes are touching each other. Internal rotation of the thighs. Press into the hands and the feet. Open up, extend, four and five. Now we'll come on down. Dasha, inhale, lift your bum. Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Dwadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. Ardha Baddha Padma, Pashmottanasana, Sapta, jump through. Take your right leg into half lotus or into rock the baby if your hip's not ready. Reach around with that right hand, grab the left foot or left side shirt. Left hand reaches for left foot. Inhale and ashtao. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five. Now inhale, look up. Exhale there. Dasha, inhale, lift up. Ikadasha, exhale, jump back. Duwadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. Chaturdasha, jumping through. Left leg, half lotus, or rock the baby. Reach around, left hand, right side shirt, or left foot. Right hand reaches for right foot, no matter where you are. Inhale, and panchadasha. Exhale, forward folds. Good. One. Keep reaching your sternum towards that right big toe. Two, keep looking forward unless your whole body's on that thigh. Three, four, five. Shodasha, inhale, look up. Exhale there. Saptadasha, inhale, lift. Ashtadasha, exhale, jump back. Ekona Vimshatihi, inhale, and Vimshatihi, exhale. Tarang Mukha Kapada Pashimotanasana. Sapta, jump through. Now bend your right leg and take it to the outside of your right hip with the ankle into the earth, toe facing the back. If that's not happening with both sits bones down, put a block horizontally underneath your sits bones to get the opening through the quadricep, the ankle, and the knee. Three, four, five. Now inhale, look up and exhale there. Dash, inhale, lift up. Ekadasha, jump back. Duwadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. Chaturdasha, jump through. Bend that left leg, take it outside of your hip. Hips are square. Eventually, knees together. Reach for your right foot. Inhale. And panchadasha, exhale, forward fold. Relax shoulders. One. Two. Try to touch your head to the top of the foot. Three, four, and five. Shodasha. Inhale, look up and exhale there. Saptadasha. Inhale, lift. Ashtadasha. Jump back. Ekona Vimshatihi. Inhale. Vimshatihi. Exhale. Janyushashasana A. Sapta jumping through. Take your right foot inside of your left thigh, left leg out straight. Reach for your left foot, inhale, and ashtao, exhale, forward fold, reaching your heart and your gaze towards that left big toe for one, trying to relax that right glute, right hip, two, three, four, five. Now inhale, look up, exhale there. Dasha, inhale, lift up. Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Dwadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. Chaturdasha, jumping through. Left foot inside of the right thigh. 
long spine. Reach for your right foot. Inhale, soft shoulders. And Panchadasha. Exhale, forward fold. One. Use your inhales to create length and space through the spine. Two. Lead with the heart always. Three. Four. Five. Shodasha. Inhale. Look up. And exhale there. Saptadasha. Inhale. Lift. Ashtadasha. Exhale. Jump back. A kona vim shatihi. Inhale. Vim shatihi. Exhale. Jan yubi. Sapta jumping through. Right foot inside the left thigh. Now lift yourself up to take your heel into the perineum. Knee is about 80 to 85 degrees. Reach for your left foot. Inhale. And ashtau. Exhale. Forward folds for one. Two, three, four, five. Now I inhale, look up. Exhale there. Dasha inhale, lift. Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Tuadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. Chaturdasha, jumping through. Left foot inside a right thigh. Lift yourself up to take the heel into the perineum. Reach for your right foot. Inhale. Panchadasha. Exhale. Forward fold. Engaging that right leg to protect the knee and to allow the hamstring to open. Two. Three. Four. Five. Shodasha. Inhale. Look up and exhale there. Saptadasha, inhale, lift up. Ashtadasha, exhale, jump back. Ikona vim shatihi, inhale. Vim shatihi, exhale. Janu shashasana C, sapta jump through. I'm going to show you, I'm going to turn to you so you can see here. So you're taking your right foot up high into that left thigh. You've got to get a toe stretch here to open the plantar fascia and the toes. Eventually heel underneath the belly button. The knee will come down to the earth. If you're going forward, reach, inhale, and ash thou exhale, forward fold for one, two, three, four, five. Now a inhale, look up, and exhale there. Dash inhale, lift up. Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Dwadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. Chaturdasha, jumping through. Left foot high up into the right thigh. Lean over towards your right side to get the space to take the heel high up. Sit yourself up on a block horizontally to get the space if you can't quite, quite get the toe stretch. Reach for your right foot, inhale, and panchadasha, exhale, forward fold. One, two, three, four, five. Shodasha, inhale, look up, exhale there. Saptadasha, lift up. Ashtadasha, exhale, jump back. Ekona vim shatihi, inhale, vim shatihi. Exhale, Marichiyasana A. Sapta, jump through. So bend your right knee, take it to the sky, take the heel in towards your sits bones, take a hand's width distance between your foot, forward fold inside a right leg, right armpit, front to right shin, reach back with the left hand, maybe with a twist, grab your bind or grab your shirt, inhale, and forward fold, Ashtau, exhale for one, two, three, Four, five. Now inhale. Look up and exhale there. Dasha inhale. Lift up. Ekadasha. Exhale. Jump back. Duwadasha. Inhale. Triodasha. Exhale. Chaturdasha. Jump through. Left knee. Sky. Left heel. Sit bone. Hands width distance. Forward fold inside of your left leg. Wrap the armpit front of the shin. Reach it back. Big internal rotation of that left shoulder. Grab your bind. Inhale, lengthen. And panchadasha. Exhale, forward fold. Drishti or gaze is at your right big toe for one, two, three, four, 
five. Shodasha, inhale, look up, exhale there. Saptadasha, inhale, lift. Ashtadasha, exhale. Shodasha, inhale. Uh oh. And exhale. Sapta, jumping through, lost that count. Marichi B, left leg half lotus or left heel in front of your right sit bone. Right knee bends. Same as A, except now you've got that left leg involved. Reach back, grab your bind, inhale. And ashtau, exhale, forward fold, forehead or chin to the earth for one, two, three, four, five. Now I inhale, look up, and exhale there. Dasha, inhale, lift. Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Ndwadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. Chaturdasha, jumping through. This time, taking your right leg into half lotus or right heel in front of your left sit bone. Left knee to the sky. Take your forward fold inside of that left leg, left armpit, front of the left shin. Reach back, grab your bind. Inhale, and panchadasha. Exhale, forward fold. One. Two, three, four, five. Shodasha, inhale, look up, and exhale there. Saptadasha, inhale, lift up. Ashtadasha, exhale, jump back. A konavim shatihi, inhale. Vim Shatihi, exhale. Marichi Asana C, Sapta jumping through. Right knee to the sky. This time, left elbow outside of your right knee, taking your stop sign. Or if you can slide that arm down the thigh, you can rotate that left shoulder forward, bend the elbow, reach back, grab your bind, or somewhere thereabouts. Once you've got your bind, open up the chest for one. Look over your right shoulder for two. Keep that left leg active, internally rotated for three, four, five. Ashtau, inhale, lift up. Now exhale, jump back. Dasha, inhale. Ekadasha, exhale. Ndwadasha, jumping through. Left knee to the sky. Right elbow outside of left knee. Round the spine a little bit to get that arm as far down as you can, so you've got space to bend the elbow and take that arm around. Stop sign or reaching around, grab your bind. Wherever you are, look over your left shoulder and open up your chest, one. Root your sits bones down to help to lengthen the spine, strengthening erector spinae, two, three, four, five. Very nice. Triodasha, inhale, lift up. Chaturdasha, exhale, jump back. Panchadasha, inhale. Shodasha, exhale. Marichyasana D, same as C, Sapta, jumping through, except now we've got our left leg in half lotus or left heel in front of the right sit bone. Right knee to the sky. It's a twist, take your left elbow outside of your right knee into your stop sign or start to work that bind again. Bending the elbow, reaching it back. See what you can grab, your thigh, maybe you can reach around with that right hand. Good, again, open up your chest, squeeze the shoulders, look over your right shoulder for one, two, keep breathing, don't hold your breath, three, four, Five. Ashtau, inhale, lift up. Nawa, exhale, jump back. Ndasha, inhale. Ikarasha, exhale. Ndwadasha, jumping through, other side. Taking your right leg into half lotus or heel in front of the sit bone. Left knee to the sky. Right elbow outside of your left knee. Work it down there, round the chest until you go as far as you can go. Maybe that as far as you can go is getting your bind. Once you've got your bind or your stop sign, open up your collarbones, 
reach that left arm around, look up, one, two, root down whatever's touching the earth to rise, prana energy rising, three, four, and five. <clears throat> Excuse me, Triodasha, inhale, lift up, Chaturdasha, jump back. Panchadasha, inhale. Shodasha, exhale. Navasana, Sapta, jumping through for your boat pose. Palms facing each other, shoulders squeezing, belly tucked. One, try to get the legs straight. Two, toes pointed. Three, long spine. Four, five. Ashtau, inhale, lift up. Exhale, lower. Sapta, again. One, two, Three, four, five. Ashtau, inhale, lift up. Exhale, lower, Sapta again. One, two, three, four, five. Ashtau, inhale, lift up. Exhale, lower, Sapta. Two more to go. Don't collapse through the chest. One, squeeze the shoulders. Two, tuck the belly. Three, straighten the legs. Four, five, Ashtau, inhale, lift up. Last one, Sapta. One, two, three, four, five. Ashtau, inhale, lift up. Now I exhale, jump back. Dasha, inhale. Ekkadasha, exhale. Bhuja Pidasana. Sapta, hop your feet around your hands or hop right into Bhuja. If you're walking, um, take your hands behind your heels, walk the heels in towards each other, cross the right ankle over the left eventually, and maybe taking your chin to the earth, ashtau, exhale. If you're already in the posture, very slowly, now inhale, come on up and exhale there. Now we can all take bakasana, dasha, inhale, bakasana, ekadasha, jump back, duadasha, inhale, Triodasha, exhale, Kurmasana, Sapta, hop your feet around your hands, and this time come to sit down on your bum. If it doesn't happen with you jumping around your hands, that's okay. Come down to your bum, take your leg into a wide V with the arms underneath, fingers reaching back, palms to the earth. Eventually your shoulders will be underneath your knees. Internal rotation of the thighs, toes towards the sky, flex the feet, maybe even lift the heels too. Three, four, five. Supta Karmasana. Now maybe staying where you are, or Ashtau inhale, reaching back to grab the bind with your hands. And then now uh, exhale, start to walk your heels in, eventually crossing your right ankle over your left. Eventually those heels will be behind your head. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, hands come to the ground. Now I inhale, lift up to Titi Basana, and exhale there. We can all take crow again, so come into Bakasana, Dasha. Inhale, Bakasana, Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Duwarsha, inhale, Triodasha, Exhale, Garbha Pindasana, Sapta, jump through to your seat. Take full lotus, half lotus, cross legs, whatever you can get. It's a balance. So lift your knees up, either take your arms through for Kukutasana arms, or wrap your arms around, grab a bind. Good, hug your knees into your chest and hold for one, two, three, four, Five, now exhale, rock and roll nine times around in a clockwise circle. One, two, I'm counting your breath, not your rocks. Four, and five. Ashtau, inhale, lift up to Kukutasana or Tolasana. One, press into the earth. Two, tuck your belly in your pelvic floor. Three, four, five. Now I'll come on down. Good, okay. Dasha, inhale, lift up. Ikadasha, jump back. 
Dwadha Sha, inhale, Triyodha Sha, exhale, Baddha Konasana, sup to jump through. Soles of feet together, knees out to the side, draw your heels in towards your pelvic bone and let your feet open up like a book. Thumbs on the inside, fingers on the out, encourage it. Inhale, with a long spine, Ashtau, exhale, forward fold, keep reaching your heart forward, chin eventually to the earth. One, two, three, four, and five. Now inhale, look up, dasha, exhale, round your forehead towards the floor or your toes for one, two, three, four, and five. Ekadasha, inhale, look up, exhale there. Draw your knees together, dwadasha, inhale, lift up. Triodasha, exhale, jump back. Chaturdasha, inhale, Panchadasha, exhale, Upavishta Kanasana. Start to jump through into your wide V. Reach for the pinky toe side of the feet. Bring your feet or your legs a little bit closer together if you can't quite reach. And Ashtau, exhale, forward fold for one. Thighs engaged. Two. Heart reaching, spine long. Three. Four. And five. Now inhale, come on up, exhale there, and lift your feet up to your hands. Let your head fall back and look up to the sky if you can for one. Pelvic floor strongly engaged, Mula Bandha, two. So is Uddiyana Bandha, belly, three, four, five. Inhale, bring your feet together, hands to the ground. Dasha, inhale, lift up. Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Dwarasha, inhale. Triyodha Sha, exhale, Supta Kanasana, Sup to jump through, come to lay down flat. Ashtau, inhale, take your feet behind your head in your wide V and grab your big toes. Balancing on your shoulders for one. Sits bones are lifting. Two, keep length through the spine. Three, straight legs if you can. Four, and five. Now I inhale, rock up to a V, hold it there in a light forward fold with a big V. Good. Inhale, exhale, dasha, inhale, lift, ekadasha, jump back. Dwadasha, inhale, try odasha, exhale. Supta padangushtasana, sup to jump through, come to lay down flat, left hand top of the left thigh. Ashtau, inhale, grab that right big toe. Now I exhale, chin to your shin for one, two, Three, four, five. Dasha, inhale, shoulders come down. Ikkadasha, exhale, leg goes to the right, left hip grounded. Look over your left shoulder. One, toes to the earth in line with the head. Two, three, four, five. Dwadasha, inhale, bring that leg up. Triodasha, exhale, chin to your shin. Chaturdasha, inhale, shoulders come down. Panchadasha, exhale, left leg, right leg comes down. Shodasha, inhale. Saptadasha, exhale, chin to your shin. One, two, three, four, five. Ashtadasha, inhale, shoulders come down. Ekonavim shatahi, exhale, take that left leg out to the left side. Right hip grounded, look over your right shoulder. One, two, Three, four, and five. Inhale, bring that leg up. Ekona vimshatahi. Eka vimshatahi, chin to shin. Dwa vimshatahi. Inhale, shoulders come down. Trio vimshatahi. Left leg comes down. Chatur vimshatahi. Chakrasana or rock to the front. Find a lift. To punch of vimshatahi. Chaturanga. Show vimshatahi. Inhale, sapta vimshatahi. Exhale, downward dog. Sapta, jump through for Ubaya Padangushtasana. Ashtau, inhale. Take your feet behind your head and grab a hold of your big toes. Now, uh, exhale right away. Come up to your balancing V. Point your toes to help you get there. One, squeeze your shoulders. Lift your chest. Two, three, four, five. Hands come down, legs cross. Dasha, inhale, lift up. Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Dwadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. Urdhva Mukha Paschimottanasana, Sapta, jump through. Come to lay down flat. Ashtau, inhale. Take your feet behind your head and grab the sides of the feet, this time below the heels. 
Now exhale, rock forward. Once you're up, bend the elbows, bring your body to your thighs, chin to your shin, look up towards your toes, one. Long spine, two, three, four, five. Hands come down to the ground. Once you straighten your arms, dasha, inhale, lift up, ikarasha, jump back. Duarsha, inhale, triodasha, exhale, satu bandhasana, septa, jump through and come to lay down flat. Charlie Chaplin, your feet, flex your feet, heels together, toes out to the side. Bend your knees a little bit so you can walk up into the elbows to create a bridge through your spine, lifting your chest, dropping the crown of the head to the earth. And if you're like me, you have to move your ponytail out of the way to get into the posture. Once you are there, arms crossing, press into the feet and lift the hips. You can keep your elbows down for support or you can take a bridge here instead. Eventually crossing the arms in front of the chest, legs straight, feet rooted. One, two, three, four, five. Now come on down, tuck your chin. Dasha, you take Chakrasana or you come to the front and find your lift. Ekadasha, jump back, Chaturanga. Dwarasha, inhale, Triodasha, exhale. All right, back bends. Supta, jumping through. We're going to do three. Come to lay down flat. Bend your legs, take your feet hip distance or wider, but make sure your feet are parallel. You can touch your heels with your middle finger most times here. Press to the inside edge of the feet, coming up into bridge or to wheel. Inter inner thighs are active here. That's why we press to the inside edge of the feet to keep us out of our glutes. Ashtau, inhale, lift up to your bridge or wheel for one, two, open the ribs, open the hips, three, try to get your arms and your legs straight, four, five. Now, touch your head down if you're in wheel and walk your hands in towards your heels. Ashtau, inhale, lift up, one, try to keep your heels out and your toes in, feet parallel. Two, it's hard, I know. Three, this keeps us out of our lower back though. Four, five, nice. Now exhale, touch your head down, walk your hands in, and last one. I think it is, no it's not, ashtau, inhale. We're actually doing five, lift up. One, we're gonna do five. Two, three, Four, five. Now you can lift up here if you're used to doing drop backs or you touch your head down and walk in. Good, ashtau, inhale, lift up for one. Otherwise you're doing your drop backs. Two, you can see me there doing it. Three, usually you're not gonna do this unless you practice it with um, an authorized teacher. Four, and five. So if you're in your wheel, touch down. Walk your hands in, last one, and ashtau, inhale, lift up, one, two, three, four, and five, good. Now I'll come on down. From here, you're going to take Chakrasana, or you're going to rock to the front, dasha, inhale, lift up. Ikarasha, exhale, jump back. Nduwadasha, inhale, upward dog. Triodasha, exhale, downward dog. Jumping through for Paschimottanasana. Sapta, jump through, take your forward fold for one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now inhale, look up, exhale there. Dash, inhale, lift up. Ekarasha, jump back. Nduwadasha, inhale. Triadasha, exhale. Sarvangasana, Sapta, jump through. Come to lay down flat for your shoulder stand. 
Ashtao, inhale, lift your hips, take your feet to the sky and take your hands to your low back, low waist or low ribs. Please make sure that you're on your shoulders and not your neck. In fact, no part of the spine. Walk your elbows in so they're shoulder distance. One, drishti is at your toes or your nose. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now a exhale, halasana. Start to take the top of the feet to the earth behind your head. Try to keep length through your spine. If you don't use your hands at your back to support, interlace them and take the pinkies to the earth. Long arms, one. Lift your sits bones up towards the sky and your sacrum towards the top of your mat, two. Toes and heels together if you can, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Now I exhale, Karna Pidasana, ear pressure pose. Bend your knees, squeeze them into the ears. Toes and heels stay together. One. Eventually, knees, shins, ankles, top of feet, and toes are into the earth. Two, three, four, five. Seven, eight. Ashtau, inhale. Come back up to shoulder stand for Urdhva Padmasana. Take lotus, half lotus or cross legs. If you don't need your hands at the back to support you, take your hands to your knees and push the knees away so your arms are straight like you're sitting on the ceiling, still on your shoulders. Don't roll onto your neck. Be careful. One, two. In fact, root your upper back and your shoulders down. It'll help. Three, Lots of core engagement here to hold this. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now a exhale, Pindasana. Drop your knees down towards the earth. And you're going to grab either the sides of your thighs or you're going to wrap your arms around your legs in a bind. Again, be careful you don't roll onto your neck. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Matsyasana. Now exhale, slowly start to roll out. So take your hands down to the ground and you're going to slowly roll out like one vertebrae at a time until the sacrum is down to the earth. And then once the sacrum's down, take your knees down, lift up to the elbows and create a bridge through your spine like we did in Setu Bandhasana. Drop the head back, and if you don't need your elbows to support you here in this lovely back bend, you're going to take your hands to the top of the feet or the thighs. One, lift your sternum, drop your shoulders. Two, imagine reaching your breastbone towards the back of your mat where your gaze is. Three, opening up middle and upper thoracic. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Ashtau, inhale. Open up to Uttana Padasana. Arms and legs out 45 degrees, hovering above the earth. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now I exhale. Come on down. Tuck your chin in carefully. Dasha, you take Chakrasana or rock to the front. Find a lift. Ikarasha, exhale, jump back, chaturanga. I take a little bit of time in this. <laughs> Indwadasha, inhale, upward dog. Triodasha, exhale, downward dog. Shirshasana, headstand pose. So come down to your knees, create a cradle that will support the back of your head, interlacing your hands. Now, the palms are not together. Those palms are going to support the back of your head. Take the top of the head to the earth. Inhale. Lift the knees up once you've supported the back of your head. Yeah, walk the toes up and then you come up one leg at a time or both legs, either bent or straight. One. You can go to a wall for sure. Two. Elbows are shoulder distance. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. 
8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Now I exhale. You don't have to go here. This is optional. But maybe you start to take your legs parallel to the earth in pike. In order to do that, you have to shift your sacrum way back to find that beautiful center line of gravity of balance, finding the fulcrum. One, two, belly is strongly engaged, Uddiyana Bandha. Three, legs are straight, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Ashtau, inhale, come back up, Shirshasana. Now exhale, come down slow as molasses in January, like my mom used to say. So if you don't know what that means, it means just like come down really, really slow with control. And then take child's pose. Let everything relax. Let the neck muscles relax, the upper back, the shoulders, the chest. All right, hands underneath your shoulders, dasha, exhale, jump back, chaturanga. Ekadasha, inhale, upward dog, dwadasha, exhale, downward dog. Bada padmasana, finishing postures. Sapta, jump through to your seat. Take full lotus, half lotus, or cross legs here. Remember, in lotus, we always take the right leg first and then the left leg on top, and when we're binding, you take the left hand around first to grab the left big toe or take it to your right side waist. And then the right arm goes on top, reaching for either left elbow or that right big toe or foot. Once you've got your bind or the elbows, inhale and ashtau, exhale, forward fold. Eventually chin to the earth for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now, uh, inhale, come on up into Padmasana. So you're going to come up and you're going to take Dhyan Mudra, index finger and thumb together. All the other fingers are touching. Drishti will be at the tip of your nose. Nice long spine, shoulder squeezing, heart always open. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Last bit of effort. Aputa he. Hands in front of the hips slightly because you want to be able to roll into your upper body strength. Remember, you're going to pull your pelvic floor and your belly in in order to lift your butt off of the ground. Ashtau, inhale. Lift up. One, two, three. Four, five, keep pressing into the earth. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now I come on down. Dasha, inhale, lift up. Ekadasha, exhale, jump back. Dwadasha, inhale. Triodasha, exhale. And Sapta, floating your feet up to the hands, halfway lift, Ashtau, exhale, forward fold. Now inhale, rise up. So this is where you would do closing mantra if you were doing it. And from here, you're going to come into your last vinyasa that will take you into rest. You can see I'm just chanting there, doing closing mantra.
All right. Final vinyasa to rest. Bacon inhale, reach hands high. Dway exhale, forward fold. Trini inhale, look up. Chatwari exhale, Chaturanga. Punch inhale, Urdhva Mukha. Shat exhale, Adho Mukha. Sapta inhale, jump through. Come to lay down flat and take rest. Beautiful practice, everybody. Let yourself go here. Let the body process the work you've done. Surrender.